Hello students. Today we are going to start lesson number 4, nouns. You all know what is noun. You have learnt in the lower classes that noun is a naming word. It is a name of a person, place, animals or things. Now today we will start with the understanding of different types of nouns. Common nouns. These are the general names given to persons, animals, places or things which are which are of the same kind. They do not necessarily begin with a capital letter. Now, common nouns do not begin with a capital letter. And these are the general names given for these persons, animals, places or things. Examples, men. Man can be any man. We have not given any specific name of a person. Cities. There are so many city, cities. But here we are referring to these different cities in general. Countries. There are many countries. But we are referring in a general. Day, week, month, year. So there are days, seven days a week. There are four weeks in a month. There are 12 months in a year. So all these are the general names. Now proper nouns. These are the names of particular persons, animals, places or things. They always start with a capital letter. Now, common nouns are the general names and proper nouns are the particular names. These are the names of particular person, animal, place or a thing. Shimla, it is a particular name of a city. India, particular name of a country. Monday, it is a particular day. Sunday, also a day. January, particular month. December, also particular month. So, understood students? Now, see, we are, we are given some examples. Common nouns and proper nouns. Newspapers. Now, newspaper can be any, in any language, any state. The Times of India, the Hindustan Times, the Hindu. Then man and women, Bhavya, Pragya, Mahatma Gandhi. Countries, India, Switzerland, Britain. Towns and cities, Agra, Jaipur, Mathura. Rivers, the Ganga, the Yamuna. Days and months, Monday, Wednesday, July, August. Buildings, the Red Fort, the Taj Mahal. So, all these are the common nouns and their proper nouns. Now, we'll start with the first question of exercise, that is question A. Write three proper nouns for each common noun given below. What you have to do here, students? Here you are given a common noun and for this common noun, you have to write three proper nouns. First is day. So, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Students, you can write the name of any day. You can also write Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. You can write Sunday, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. You can write in this way also. You can write any name of the day. Now, number two, river. Thames, Ganga, Yamuna. Now, I have written here three names of the river. You can write any other name also if you want. Number three. Cartoon character, Beam, Doraemon, Noddy. Here also students, you can write any cartoon you like. You can write the name of any cartoon. Number 4, TV channel, Star Plus, Aaj Tak, Pogo. Again the same thing, you can write the name of any TV channel. Number 5, book, Stuart Little, it is a storybook. Glitters, it is a English book which you all are studying. Sugandh, it is a Gujarati book. So, these are the particular names of books. Students, you can also write the name of any story books which you read. Any other book which you have and you read, you can write any name. Now, from 6 to 10 in homework. You have to do, you have to do this in same way. Now, we will start next exercise B. 
write one word from the help box for the following statements now here you are given one help box and for this from this help box you have to write one word for this now number 1 the person who teaches us is a who teaches us who teaches you all in school teacher so we will write teacher from this box number 2 the person who protects the country is a students who protects the country soldier so we have written here soldier and we'll underline soldier number 3 the person who cuts our hair is who cuts our hair barber so we have written here barber and we'll underline it number 4 the person who cooks in hotels is students whenever you are going to hotel and you have dinner or lunch over there who is cooking that who cooks that food in that hotel chef so we will underline chef and we have written here chef so students in the same way you have to understand the statement and then you have to select a proper word and then you have to write from 5 to 8 you have to do in the homework now we'll start with exercise c look at the following pictures write p for a person p i for a place T for a thing and A for an animal in the circle provided besides each picture. So, students, here you are given the pictures. Now you have to identify whether it is a person, place, animal, or a thing, and then accordingly you have to write the shortcut given here in the circle. So here we can see a picture in which a a doctor is there. So doctor is a person. So what we'll write for person? We'll write P. So we have written here P. Here we are given a picture of lion. So lion is an animal. So we'll write A for animal here. Now here we are given a book. Book is a thing. So we'll write T for this. Here we are given a picture of a rabbit. Rabbit is an animal. So we have written here A. Here we are given a picture where we can see a river is there, garden like view is there. So it is a place. So we will write P L. And again here also we are given a picture of a place. So P L. So students, in the same way you have to identify these pictures and you have to write, you have to write their category.